Now I'm gonna give you a dish that my family absolutely love. It's Singapore style fried rice. And it is a brilliant dish in this environment where we're kind of making do with things we have and haven't got, right? There's thousands of recipes, but it's having that kind of sumptuous rice and it's got tang and seasoning. And of course it's littered with beautiful veggies. Classically, there'd be some kind of like smoky ribs or ham or prawns. We've got no meat in the fridge. I've got bacon and I've got a bit of sausage. So I thought I'd put that in there as well. I've got an egg. Veg wise, there's bits and pieces of tatty stuff. So I've got two little asparagus spears here. There's a bit more at the back. I've got two corn, two tomatoes, a bit of broccoli, um, some leek and some cabbage and some carrot. You can swap in and out any veggies that you've got. I'm just gonna slice the asparagus here. We've got our tomatoes here that can go into quarters. Sprout and broccoli here. You can use regular broccoli, cauliflower if you like. So look, there's our broccoli. Now, when it comes to the leek, you could use onion, spring onion, and I'm gonna just try and finely slice that. Cabbage, now you could use savoy cabbage, Chinese cabbage, spinach, bok choy, pak choy. From a nutrition point of view, from your body, it's like, yes, come on, give it to me. I have got frozen prawns, which I found at the bottom of the freezer. You can thaw them out, just putting them in a bowl with some running water, no trouble. Now here is the fragrant part, ginger and garlic. If you haven't got one or the other, honestly, it doesn't matter. Slice it, very, very easy, and let's get cooking. Get yourself a nice, large, non-stick pan, get it nice and hot. Now, the egg element, I do something slightly different. I just wanna crack the egg into this bowl. So eggs have been slightly in short supply. Last week was a bit harder, this week's a little bit better. You'll get two portions out of each one egg. A little bit of oil goes in the pan. So this beaten egg here goes straight in the pan and I'm gonna move the pan around and you're essentially creating like a little egg pancake. And let it cook away. And then you'll see it starts to be cooked. It's quite satisfying actually in a sort of weird way. And you make this, look at that. Look how beautiful that is, Jules. Like a little stained glass window. Why are you pushing? <laughs> Sorry. Um, so what we're gonna do with this then is basically roll it up. And I'll slice that up later and toss that through the rice. Now let's just talk about the rice. I prefer doing this with white basmati rice, but I didn't have any, run out. So that is brown rice, more nutritious, bonus. I actually added to that because I've got seven people to feed. Um, just one little nest of rice noodles, because that's all I had left. Basically, whatever rice or rice noodles you've got, you can use for this. I just refresh it in cold water, and you definitely have to have it cold, otherwise it will not work. It will stick. Right, you can see the pan is nice and hot. A little bit of oil. I'm gonna get my sausage, slice it up into little bits. Sausage goes in. That's random, normally it's ham. Um, so this is when you can get your jiggle on. When you've got color on that, then we can go in with our prawns. I'm only gonna use like four prawns. We can also go in with our ginger and our garlic. So give that a nice little stir up. You can see there's a little bit of color happening now. It smells amazing in here. Okay, can you get a close up on this curry paste? Feel free to use any curry paste you want. Just a little teaspoon is all you need. We're gonna go in with our beautiful veggies. Give it a nice little toss. The asparagus goes in. Smells really, really nice. I'm gonna go in with just my portion of the rice. So I would say it's about equal quantities of veg to rice for me. And then you wanna season the rice with soy sauce. I think what's really nice as well is, honestly, sorry, I got that over the sofa. Okay, I'm really upset you now. Yeah. You get like a dust sheet or something. Yeah. So look, come and have a look at this, Jay. This is that pancake that I rolled up. Can you see how what you essentially create in seconds with zero effort and no talent at all is really like egg tagliatelle. Look at that. And then put that into my rice to move it all around and break up all the rice. Okay, so I'm gonna plate it up now. Look at the colors, guys. That is my expression of Singapore rice. It's brilliant for now, guys, brilliant for now. It's a fantastic dish. So look, enough yapping, get in there. I do really like the mixture of rice and noodles. Truly, truly flexible dish. Surf and turf, loads of veg, big enough rice noodles. A super flexible dish that I know will be really great for you guys now. Jules, what do you want to say? You eat that, I'll clean the cushions and laugh. That's good. That's good. Bud, what do you reckon? Buzz is sad, not you, Buzz? Buzz is sad because he thought he'd lost he river. He thought he lost river in the, in the uh, garden, but. Yeah, he thought he lost river. <laughs>
folks. What do you reckon? Really good. Right, girls, teenagers, mum, how do you find it? So good. <laughs> very, very tasty.